Hey, love. I know, but a big project came up and they need me to stay late for a bit. Yeah, I'm gonna have to cancel. I'm so sorry, sweetheart. I will make it up to you. I got Ryan covering me Friday night to make up for this debacle. <laughs> exactly, he owes me. Figured he could cover me for once. Anyways, I'm not gonna be back until late, so don't bother waiting up. I know, but I don't want to find you passed out on that crappy couch again. It does hurt your back. It's cheap and old. We really need to buy a new one. Go to sleep on our nice, comfy bed. I'll be there when you wake up. Promise. All right. Good night, sweetheart. Thought that would never end. Just form after form. Ryan owes me way more than just one covered night. Why are the lights on? Don't tell me she. And she is asleep on the couch. So much for using the bed. Sweetheart, can you hear me? She's out like a light. Always been a heavy sleeper. You really should have used the bed, love. Now your back's gonna hurt tomorrow. Sweetheart? Hey, I'm home now. You're really out, huh? Work must be getting to you. I know you try to hide it, but I've been seeing you yawn more and more. You toss and turn at night, but whenever I ask you about it, you just shrug and say it's nothing. You're an awful liar, love. But I guess you're my awful liar, right? I'm such a sap. I never thought I'd be doing the cliche, talking to my sleeping partner scene. But, gotta admit, it's nice to be able to tell you this without you pushing back. Cause for some stupid reason, you don't think you're cute. But I blame your asshole ex for that. But hey, that's an argument for another time. You know, I can't just leave you on this couch, right? But I know as soon as I move you, you're gonna open those sleepy eyes and give me that adorable deer in headlights look that you get whenever you get woken up. I don't want to wake you up. I want you to sleep, but I can't let you sleep here. I'm so glad you're not awake for this. I don't think you'd ever let it go. Worse than the time you found out I was scared of birds. To be fair, birds are creepy. Cats know where you stand. Birds, though. You're so skinny. Have you been forgetting to eat at work again? How did I not notice? We're gonna have to talk about this tomorrow. Maybe over pancakes. Or waffles. Or both. When you first agreed to move in with me, I was so happy. I hated whenever you had to leave. I used to dread our dates ending. Tried to come up with every excuse in the book to keep you with me. Because whenever you left, I just felt so... empty. Like my perfect life wasn't so perfect when you weren't with me. And now here you are. 
passed out on this couch that I really need to toss out. Okay, it's time for bed. Sweetheart, it's just me. Go back to sleep. It's late. You're on the couch again. And I'm taking you to bed. I know as soon as I change, I'll be right there. I'm home now. I've got you. We can talk in the morning. I know how tired you are. Get some rest, love. I've got you. Go back to sleep. I love you too. Good night. Thank you for listening. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Shout out to the patrons as always, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.